All right, in today's lesson, you're going to create an invitation for the eighth grade graduation, which will take place in June. It seems like it's a long way off, but it'll be here before you know it. Um, you're going to download this file to get you started, and it has uh, four different panels on it, and then you fold it together to create the invitation. All right, the first thing you're going to do is you're going to um, just make sure you're clicked on panel number one and you're going to insert shapes find um, rectangle and you're just gonna do one big rectangle right in the workspace area of the first panel and we're going to go shape fill choose yellow we're going to go shape outline uh, weight is how thick the outline border is and we're going to go to three okay so that's how we're going to get started all right the next thing we're going to do is we're going to go to insert and we're going to go to draw a text box and we're going to change the font oh first before we do that let's go to home uh, let's go ahead and center the cursor we're going to change the font to uh, lucida calligraphy these are all in alphabetical order Is that one right there 18 points and bold Okay, the next thing we're going to do is let's resize this text box. Not that much. Something like that, just so everything's still visible. Okay. All right, the next thing is we're going to go ahead and insert another text box. I'm going to put it at the bottom and this time you're going to put the same font I have to go back to home and center this time put 16 for your size Class of 2016. Make that bold also. Okay. All right. Uh, the next thing we're going to do go to insert shapes, and I want you out of the basic shapes, find the oval. But before we draw our oval, you're going to hold your shift key down because that will make a perfect circle. Okay. Go up here to shape styles and choose the very first one. All right. So far, so good, hopefully. All right. Now we're going to use our old. Uh, logo that we've been using. Uh, I will have this available for download again, but we're going to go to insert to the uh, picture. And I am going to resize this, make it smaller so that it's going to fit right in that circle. 
All right, now to give it just a little bit more uh, of a nicer look, let's put borders around our two text boxes. So I'm going to go up here right on the frame of this and double click. Shape outline. Weight. One and a half. Double click down here and we're going to do the same thing. Shape outline. Weight. One and a half. All right, I think uh, panel number one looks pretty good.